All right, my name is Derek Diedrichson. I run a blog called RelaxShacks.com. Just doing a quick ad lib one take video here narration wise. This is my studio in Stoughton, Massachusetts, uh, an old boot factory building that was renovated by Steve Kelly, who did a fantastic job. This is some stuff I'm working on, which ties into the time lapse video you'll see shortly. Hang in there. This is some of my art as well. I do a lot of custom pieces and that. Uh, this and that, I guess I would say. And uh, a lot of it's listed on my Derek Diedrichson Facebook page and elsewhere. So just a couple pieces just to show you some of the weird, wacky, wild, whimsical stylings of what I do. This is a Death Star piece I just did for a friend recently. Yes, I'll do one on commission, but my God, it took a long time. And uh, wrapping things up with the photos here, I want to show you this time-lapse video of a robot project I'm working on. Which might sound weird, but this is part of a plan I have, a fun one to revitalize, slowly, part of Stoughton, uh, Wyman Street downtown, where there are a lot of empty businesses and kind of aesthetically it's lacking. So the idea is I'm taking scrap pieces of wood, and I got these from Steve Kelly, actually, who uh, was doing some home renovations and was more or less chucking this wood. He gave me a bunch of pieces of wood with a spray paint stencil I'm making some robots. I want to get the Cub Scouts involved, some other people in town as well. And I'm making these funky little robots. Uh, I want to start a geocaching program to get some people from out of town or people in town down in the downtown area, Wyman Street again. Um, I figure if you can get people down there with a free attraction like this, geocaching is more or less like a Where's Waldo um, hunt for art with GPS coordinates. But if I could get them walking around downtown Stoughton looking for 20 or so funky robots all decorated differently, different colors, different styles, um, I've kind of achieved the goal of getting people in the center of town where right now there is certainly a lack of that. If you get people in town, walking around, they're more prone to buy a coffee, get a haircut, buy a sub, go to chicken kebab, go to, uh, you know, buy some Army-Navy surplus stuff at Uncle Milty's, and mission accomplished, like I said. And it would be fun because I'm getting the community involved here as well. It'd be something we could promote easily. i do videos such as this one, but much more high quality and planned out. And uh, like I said, you're attracting people into town to partake in a free uh, game or exercise that would be... A heck of a lot of fun. It's like hide-and-seek seek, uh, with robots and very billable in a PR sense with local newspapers and such. So I think it would work. I want to do about 20 of these, like I said, with the Cub Scouts. I'm going to do the bulk of them, and uh, we'll see what happens. Keep checking out Stoughton, Mass, and Art Town on Facebook for more info on this.